Hello, my name is Paul Boysen and I'm the professional nurse, the nurse for PWID, community nurse for Nova. Well, we go out with the mobile. This is our mobile vehicle that we go out with. We work with a team of plus minus eight guys that we go out with and uh, we find PWIDs, PWUDs, people who inject drugs, people who use drugs. Um, we work with the referral team, taking them to clinics. If unfortunately they are HIV positive, we refer them to the clinics. So um, in a nutshell, that's what we do for the entire day. Yeah. Then we would go to where we would meet our peers um, who go out and do a so-called hunting of, um, of our client. Uh, we pick them up and then we go to a certain site that we've chosen for the day and um, we would park our mobile unit in a place where not everybody can see what's happening or hear what's happening inside for with every consultation that our clients go through. Our peer educators who are hunters of our clients would go out um, in twos, normally male and female, um, just so that you can be able to get a bigger reach of, um, of clients. Maybe sometimes female clients aren't as comfortable speaking to male clients and um, vice versa. So normally a male and a female will go out wearing their Jap Smart t-shirt as well as having an HR pack bag. So we have what we call harm reduction packs. The packs consist of new sterile needles, it consists of sterile water, it consists of alcohol swaps, as well as condoms that the guys, we give out packs and um, the guys are then taught how to use the cellar water, they're taught how to use the new clean needles, they're taught how to clean the site where they're going to inject, they're taught how to uh, dispose of them correctly. We would then go out and approach um, some individuals who are um, injecting uh, or who are seen to be injectors or carry, have, have any of the symptoms um, or characteristics of an individual who is injecting. And uh, testing them in HIV counseling and testing, we do the HIV counseling and testing and then we just distribute the, the, the harm reduction packs. My role when going out with the team is uh, making sure that I take clients whom the, the guys on the field have seen to the clinic. Sadly, a lot of the guys are HIV positive. If we tend an estimate, if we test an estimation of about 15 clients a day, more than 10 of them are positive. But um, that's through sharing of needles, that's through uh, there's 10 of them sharing one needle, that's through um, them not having the correct education. When I say correct injecting properly, that's uh, them um, having unprotected sex, you know not having condoms during intercourse etc so unfortunately yes it's quite high um, the issues that we have at the moment is just for them still to identify the mobile because remember we a new project we started on the first of june so we still have a lot of sites that we have to get to we still have a lot of clients that we have to get to we still have a lot of clients that has to go to the referrals to the clinics for anything from hrv uh, sti or tb so it's finding the clients and it's taking them to the clinic. So we just experience a little bit of problems there, but it's not something that we're getting, uh, we're getting across to the guys and a lot of them are starting to identify with us now at the moment through the clinic and their friends. At the moment we're still in Region F. Um, the whole of Region F, it's quite a big region. So we're looking at Bears Valley, um, Jeppies Town, we're looking at Hillbrow, Yeovil, we're looking at Mayfair. So we go most of Region F at the moment.